Fans from all over the world finally getting to know who they're going to, their team is going to play, uh, where, uh, against whom and when. And uh, from there we'll start the expectations, prepare trips, buy tickets, uh, have office games, challenges and, uh, and all the, the hype that precedes a World Cup. There are two rules which are key to us FIFA. The first one is that there is a, a sporting and geographic balance in the way the draw is conducted. And the second one is to ensure that the rules of the draw are simple enough for everyone to understand. Hosting the World Cup, the biggest sporting event in the world, is an amazing opportunity. Not only to create real benefits after the event through the investment in infrastructure, but also to gain a once-in-a-lifetime global marketing exposure. It's the FIFA World Cup. I've long been waiting for this. And now it's a watch chance to show the world how we do it in Africa. From the beginning of the World Cup in 1930, almost every time the World Cup was hosted on a continent, it was won by a team from that continent. This was always true, uh, with the exception of maybe 1958 when Brazil and Pelé came to win in Sweden. 